Well, welcome to Northern Ants, and we are finally getting to our unboxing from Tar Heel Ants. I got it quite a while ago. Got the box. It's been sitting in my room. I've been just looking at it like, I want to open it, but we had some other stuff we had to wait for it to come in, and uh, as you can see, we finally got our green screen, uh, so we can have some ants in the background and some bleed through. Uh, my first attempt at using a green screen, so it can only improve which I hope, <laughs> but okay, well, we're getting this box busted open, and uh, we'll see what we got. As you can see, that webcam, that's one of the things I got. Got a new webcam for the channel, so higher quality, so a good Logitech um, webcam. Okay, well, let's start unpacking some of these peanuts. The peanuts came in handy when I had to move from back from Illinois because they ma made good for shipping <laughs> when I went down there and then when I came home. All right, we got our accessories. All these things we'll go over in more detail at the end of the video as we take a close look at the MIDI Labyrinth. Few more out of the way here. I've been playing around with different cameras and different camera angles and and stuff, so it's kind of fun trying to improve the videos for you all. I really appreciate you coming by and watching the video. If you're, you know, if you do like it, you know hit that you know hit that subscribe button if you if you wouldn't mind following my channel and hitting that bell icon it would really be appreciated help my channel grow so I can continue to provide uh, quality videos for you to watch I have multiple different kinds I do ant videos but I also do animals and I have a chipmunk and I've got my cat and I've got deer and I do snowmobiling in the winter, and I do fishing and bee and wasp removal. I've got a wide range of different games that I play. So there's always something on the channel that you may like. If it's something you don't like, there's always something else that you could like. So hit those hit those uh, playlists up. Possibly you'll find something that you do. I am trying to, trying to do the green screen. Uh, well, unboxing and unwrapping that the the mini labyrinth was a little difficult because the oh we got to get that oh I almost got that larva. Let's move it over here. <laughs> um, a little fun with the green screen. That the pretty uh harvest ant queen. I had to take off the the backdrop because as you can see the the bubble wrap that and the plastic wrap that the shipped in almost the same color as my green screen so it uh did not work very well for putting in something behind it because it was just kind of drowning out the package yeah so i'm working on getting stuff opened up we'll Take a look at some more ants here. The Western Harvester ants, Pogo. This colony, this video, I think is from about a year ago. Ooh, well, let's get some of the stuff cleaned up here. Yeah, those little peanuts, they were all over the, the little pieces of I got on the green screen. It can't really eliminate that backdrop. <laughs> This video is from almost, probably almost a year ago now. Okay, well let's cut a little bit more on this. I need to get better scissors. These scissors are like, they're fairly sharp, but the mini, hurt, the mini uh, labyrinth is very well packaged. I 
love how well he packs the, the, the product he sells. There's no way things are going to get damaged. I would rather have overly packaged and have it come intact than under packaged and have it broken. <laughs> I also got, the other day, I got some flight pedals, rudder pedals, so I'll be able to do more uh, flight simulator videos. So if you're interested in those kind of videos, I will be doing some more of those. Oh, you need the rudder. <laughs> the rudder pedals, it, especially in combat games, it's hard to, hard to fly without one of your control surfaces working. Let me know down in the comments if you've had a MIDI Labyrinth and if you like it. I do have a, a regular Labyrinth that I've got my Carpenter Ants in. You can check that those videos out in my playlist on my homepage. You can see the, the, harvest, the, the Carpenter Ants are filled that Labyrinth up pretty quickly. Watching the struggle here. <laughs> Success. Yay. <laughs> Got it off. That's nice. There's a it's really nice. We're gonna take a lot closer look at the, the labyrinth at the end of the video, so stick around and we'll talk about it and kind of go over what came with it and things like that so looks really good okay now here's the nest part of it one thing I do recommend with getting any of them um, the may you know any kind fallen fortress or mini hearth or um, labyrinth or any of them I always do the museum glass because it, it gets rid of the reflection. You don't want to have reflections when you're trying to film or you're trying to watch your ants. You need light and if you got a reflection all you catch is the light. Very nice. This is the first time I've seen it. I did not see it before it was shipped. We'll talk a little bit more about why at the end of the video, once we're taking a look closer at the at the labyrinth. Unfortunately, most of my ants are in hibernation. Um, let me know in the comments if you want if you want to see what they're doing I can do some sh short short videos of them in their hibernating they're not well they're not really hibernating hibernating they've got I just haven't been giving them any protein and they're in the basement it's not too cold down there so they're not like froze or anything you don't never want to freeze your ants because they're gonna you know out in the wild they're you know they're below the frost line underground so they're they're probably warmer than we are <laughs> down there. They just, uh, the food keeps them from getting more egg, the queen from laying eggs gives her a break. Yeah, we put this together. Looking good. Okay, well, stay tuned. We're going to jump to the next part right about now. Okay, well, we got the MIDI Labyrinth unboxed here. Let's take a look at it. It's a really nice one. Thank you, Mac, uh, from Tar Hill Ants, for doing an upgrade for me. I had ordered a Fallen Fortress, and the, the day that I had ordered it, I had ordered it early in the morning, 
and he emailed me just mentioning because I had talked to him about wanting a mini labyrinth and I didn't know when he was going to be finished with it so I jumped the gun and ordered but he upgraded me to the mini labyrinth before that one shipped out so very very great for him to do that for me and he picked it out for me a really nice one uh, my uh, harvest rants will be moving into the one that's in the mini XL or the mini hearth XL uh, they're kind of bursting at the seams in that one so we're going to be moving them into this uh, mini labyrinth I'll take a little look around it um, we've got two water towers uh, like normal in the uh, labyrinth and mini labyrinth uh, we've got on the side here we've got a big plug where we can um, you know for moving ants in and things like that um, plus or adding another outworld if you need to after after time uh, the outworld it did really nice picked out um, really nice sticks and the, the rocks and stuff really look good for the for the harvester ants uh, and the side here we have a port where we can put uh, either for one I'm going to use that port for moving the ants into the mini hearth and if you see inside that came with it we got a feeding dish that came with it we've got our syringe for adding water to the mini hearth we've got our nest mate which uh, is really nice for giving them fresh water this is really cool I didn't expect to see this this is a little piece of tube which will be great for putting the two nests together I need to add get them to move in from the mini hearth into the mini labyrinth so that'll be good and we got this plug which can either you can plug this hole here with it or you can you know I use it for when I have to pull the, the nest mates out so the ants don't all come running out I plug those holes and then I notice we've got I, I like we've got another new business card it looks like it's a new make of it really nice um, I like to use these as covers for my mini hearths they they cover the the end of the or cover the glass so that the ants don't get disturbed and stuff so okay well that is our mini labyrinth oh <laughs> stuff falling all over um, I'm probably gonna do a live stream which it might be before this video is released but if you know if it is uh, the replay will be up on my channel uh, you can always go and check it out um, on the playlist uh, I don't only do ants I do animals so chipmunks and deer and, and uh, wildlife and then I do a lot of gaming also so if you're new to the channel um, feel free to come and follow my channel I would appreciate it with a subscribe and a and uh, hit the bell icon and so you know when the new videos come out there's different videos all the time I'll be doing snowmobiling when the snow starts coming down and things like that um, so I really appreciate it thank you for the the thumbs up on the video if you liked it and comment down below what you thought of the video I appreciate that very much you have a great rest of your day and I will talk to you in the comments thank you so much for stopping by and watching one of my videos if you're new to the channel don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the bell icon so you know exactly when the next video comes out I do offer a wide range of different kinds of videos so check out the playlists and you might find something else that you like other than this kind of video you watched today thank you so much comment down below what you thought or just say hi have a great rest of your day